Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mariah Perry and I'm back again with another video. I'm gonna keep things short, sweet, and simple with this intro. You're now tuned in to my, I don't even know what I wanna title it, but we're getting ready for a cruise this weekend. We're leaving on Friday, coming back on Monday. So I wanted to do a get ready with me for my Royal Caribbean cruise. So we just gonna get right into it. Here's a clip from the other day when I was doing a little unboxing of my first vacation package. My first package came, I'm going on vacation. This is what this vlog is. If y'all didn't know, now you know, cause I didn't. I don't think I did an intro yet, but we starting to vlog now. So I'm about to open this package. I'm gonna see what's inside, make sure I got everything. Can't show y'all everything because I wanna do a try on haul slash vacation essentials haul. And there's only one outfit in here, but some other essentials that I feel like would be good for vacation. So I'm open it and show y'all a few things, but that's it. First things first, a fan. And I think I'm gonna stop there. All right, I'll show y'all one more thing. Cause I wanna see it. This little jewelry holder, perfect for traveling. Everything I'm showing y'all is from Shein. This should help me keep my jewelry organized while I am not at home and i guess i'll show y'all the fan but for real for real i don't want to show y'all too much make sure y'all are subscribed so you guys don't miss that video well here's the fan and it came with the stand i think that's pretty cool so now that that's out the way we can go ahead and jump to present day today i am doing a few things I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store because I want to see if I can find a, I wanna see if I can find a nice blow dryer. The one that I do have is the Revlon one, but it's at my mom's house. Plus, I don't really think it works that well for natural hair, so I wanna find a nice blow dryer with a comb attachment. If I can't find one today in a beauty supply store, then I will have to order one from off of Amazon. I was gonna go to H&M to find a cover-up, a swimsuit cover-up, but I think I'm gonna order that from Amazon today as well. And just a few other things, I'm not about to go down the list because what's the point of vlogging if I'm gonna tell you guys everything? Um. So yeah, I'm getting ready to leave the house, to get my life in order, so we can get ready for the cruise. This beauty supply store is pretty big, so hopefully I find everything in a timely manner. Cause I'm really not trying to be in here all day. So I couldn't really I couldn't really talk much in there because they were blasting music, but I just want to do a quick run through of everything that I got out of there. I spent a total of fifty dollars and thirty five cents. I got a new bonnet because I'm getting my hair braided on Wednesday and I'm doing knotless butt length. That's never a length that I've ever done before and I knew that I would need a longer and bigger bonnet. Shampoo and conditioner so I can wash my hair. Two pairs of lashes. I wanted to do something minimal. I feel like these are minimal. What do y'all think? Let me know. Some more lash glue. I needed some more body lotion. <clears throat> y'all saw the lip gloss. And I got some hair ties for my braids. And that's it. So, obviously I went there for a blow dryer. These are some other things that were on my list. The blow dryer was in there. I think I showed you guys, but it is like $10 cheaper on Amazon. So, I'm going to order that when I get home as well as a swimsuit cover-up. Just one swimsuit cover-up. Hopefully that's here on time. Woo! And yeah, so, I'm tired of spending money. I needed some more makeup wipes, but they didn't have any in the makeup aisle. I wanted some waterproof mascara for the days I don't really feel like putting on lashes. But I'm probably not even going to wear lashes now that I think about it. So I don't even know why I got those lashes because during the day, I'm probably just going to be doing my eyebrows and that 
Okay, never mind. I will be wearing lashes at nighttime. I hope y'all could hear what I just said because I got the air on because it's hot. But yeah, and I wanted some new SD cards. I might as well order that from Amazon too. I need an SD card for my vlogging camera and possibly an SD card for my drone and my GoPro so I can get footage with those two devices. But other than that, I feel like I'm good on all the items I need to get for the trip. I already got my clothes. You guys will see a clothing haul and a travel essentials video. So make sure y'all stay tuned for that. And and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Tomorrow I'm getting a wax and Wednesday I'm getting my hair done. I'm going to see if I can squeeze in a nail appointment tomorrow. Thursday I'm filming my vacation videos like my TikTok trial hauls and my YouTube trial hauls. And then I'll be good to go for Friday. I'm trying to figure out if I want to get something to eat for lunch or if I'm just going to go home and whip something up together. But being realistic... I can't think of anything that I can make at home for lunch, honestly. I don't really want Chick-fil-A. I know that line is going to be long, Chipotle, line long. All I had to eat today was a banana. Y'all, I lost five pounds, so I'm feeling good. But I do need to eat something. Chick-fil-A lines be so long, but I'm hoping that this line goes by pretty quickly. Usually they do. Good morning, y'all. So I didn't vlog yesterday. I had a very busy, busy, busy day at work. But y'all know I like to show y'all my hair before I get it blow dried. I slept with it in a bun, but I did not put a bonnet on. So let me tell y'all before I'm running late. So remember when I went to the beauty supply store to get the blow dryer, but it was cheaper on Amazon. I ended up, I, whatever. I can't even talk. I ended up ordering that same exact blow dryer that I saw in the beauty supply store on Amazon because it was cheaper. But that blow dryer that I ordered I guess I wasn't I guess I wasn't paying attention but the blow dry that I ordered off of Amazon it does not come until today before 10 p.m. my hair appointment is today I'm gonna need it before today I would have needed it yesterday so yesterday when I got off of work I went to the beauty supply store to purchase this expensive behind blow dryer because I've heard so many good reviews about it I mean I like it but I don't know I'm still getting used to it I mean it got the job done but I say all this to say the blow dryer from Amazon gets delivered today. So I'm going to have to send it back so I can get my money back or whatever Amazon does. I think they do store credit now for returns. I don't know why they did that. Who told them to do that? But that's stupid. Um, but yeah, my hair needs a trim. But it has grown since the last time y'all saw it. But it needs a trim desperately. So I'm going to ask her if she can give me a trim. If not, I'll book it the next time I go see Brooke. Brooke basically, Brooke is the girl who does my silk presses in my area. The girl who's braiding my hair, this is my first time going to her. I've heard great reviews. She has great work. And I hear she braids fast. So my appointment starts at 9 o'clock, which is why I need to leave now because it's 7.36. And I need to get past the Charlotte traffic on I-77. And uh, not going to lie, I really wanted to stop by Chick-fil-A. So if I have the means to do so, I'm going to do that. I'm just going to check the GPS when I get in the car. But I did want to say good morning to you guys and update you guys on the blow dryer situation. Yesterday was such a long day for me and did not go as I planned. But today's a new day and we're going to keep it pushing. My hair is truly a tangled mess. I didn't know my hair got this tangled. I'm about to braid it real quick. Use the bathroom, get some water, 
pack my work bag because obviously the work don't stop and start heading on the road i just threw on a long sleeve graphic tee some sweatpants from pretty little thing and also something that i need to do every time i think i'm done shopping for this dang vacation i think of something else that needs to be done i need a new eyebrow pencil and there's one more thing oh body wash i'm running out of body wash and let me see if i can get me some obviously i'm gonna get me some but stiff behind braid look how stiff that braid is girl bye all right i'll see you guys in the next clip i'm really not sure how this happens but every time i plan on being on time i'm just never on time time I get to this part of the interstate the people over there that's trying to get on this highway it's just a whole bunch of confusion I guess people don't know how to merge over people don't know how to get over to let those people merge over like I hate driving but we're still on good timing it's 8:09 a.m. and my appointments at 9 if I get there with enough time to spare, I will be stopping by Chick-fil-A. I got my Chick-fil-A. I got a four count hash browns, some strawberry jelly, and an orange juice. And I have 16 minutes to eat. I made it to my destination. And y'all. Yeah. Mom and Dad, not me. Hi. <laughs> We need your passport, your birth certificate, or a birth certificate that says female on it. So, yeah. I need your birth certificate with that name. Everything is going so good, and then life is like, bam, not today, buddy. All my evidence of transitioning is gone. This is my first time having braids back in since... November, y'all know last year I probably have braids every month, if not every other month. So I'm really excited to have braids again. I took a break off because the process of moving, buying furniture, braids are not cheap. So that was just something I had to cut out for a few months. But I wasn't really tripping because when I moved in October, you know, fall was starting, winter. So I was rocking silk presses or twist outs but now we got our braids in i'm even more vacation ready make sure y'all go check out her page she did a great job i got medium knotless for a total of 240 dollars and i think i tipped 15 dollars and it didn't take her more than three hours and 30 minutes like we were dipping my hair at the three hour and 30 minute mark and i got i got butt length braids y'all usually i do waist but i had to go big for my first cruise oh let me not tell y'all where i'm going i'm so happy i'm so satisfied i feel so beautiful i'm so happy that i won't have to play around with my hair for the next month let's see i'm gonna give it six weeks i am just so happy and i will definitely be going back what so now I have two braiders, one in Columbia and one in the Charlotte Rock Hill area. Yeah, all her information is down below. And if you're in Columbia, check out my other braider because she's bomb too. Y'all are probably wondering, well, maybe you didn't notice what happened to my face. This is my tripod. Um, yeah, during drill two weekends ago, I busted my lip open at the range. So that's what that is. 
and that's a pimple. I feel like I didn't need to give out that disclaimer, but in case you were wondering, that's why. I don't even know what to say because I'm just so excited for tomorrow, but we do have a lot of things that need to get done today. I need to go to Target. I want a car wash. I have to get my nails done today and I need to get my wax because on Tuesday, I was supposed to get my wax on Tuesday, but work got so busy. My break was non-existent, it was crazy. So yeah, this morning I woke up early, 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 around seven o'clock a.m. I have some clothes in the washing machine. I deep cleaned the bathroom, the kitchen, you know, swept, vacuumed, mopped, all that good stuff. And yeah, I'm just trying to get, you know, the nitty gritty down so we can get to the fun part. I need to pack my bags tonight because I'm leaving at around two o'clock in the morning because I'm driving from Charlotte to Orlando. What else? I also need to film. I have some filming that I need to get done today for my channel. So make sure y'all stay tuned for that. And I think that's it. So let's go ahead and get going. I'm trying to make it to the nail salon by the time the door is open. So we're about to head out in a few. I need to pack my bags my work laptop and yeah i already know what style i'm doing with my nails that reminds me i need to go ahead and cut them because i'm getting a full set short square french tip but i want my tips to be different colors there's a car wash over here like i'm still exploring my town but i think walmart is back over here so i'm thinking I can go there for my smaller items rather than going all the way to Walmart. I mean Target. Yes, sir. Okay, so there's a car wash over here. So I guess it was meant for me to come this way. Y'all looking at my double chin, please don't. So basically I got lost. So I came to the car wash. I have like three minutes before the nail salon opens. So I'm about to try to figure out where the heck I am so I can get to the nail salon after this. I basically went to the wrong nail salon. They both had the same name. They're probably the same, you know, under the same whatever, but I really do like the one that I went to last time, so I'm gonna go back over there. I went in the wrong direction. I would say for no reason, but at least I got my car washed. That's a plus for me. But I think I know where I'm going now because this is starting to look familiar. I thought it was just taking me a different route, so I wasn't really tripping by going a different direction because I knew I was still going to get to the same place. I don't know if y'all can see, but I made it to my wax appointment. This is just too much. This is too much. Tuesday was a setup because most of this stuff that I'm doing today on a Thursday should have been done on Tuesday, but we move because God just keeps blessing us. All right. Um, here's what my nails look like. I did a, uh, this is called Strawberry Margarita by OPI. I just did a French tip, something basic, and my toes are gel, all white. This wasn't originally what I wanted to do, but when I started picking out my colors, because I was going to do the same style, but I wanted each tip a different color. When I was picking out my colors, I just couldn't find anything that I liked, so I just went with pink because pink is my favorite color, so why the heck not? It's 12.09. I have yet to eat lunch. And um, and I have yet to go to Target. Where's my phone? I have a graphic due for the Panthers tomorrow, but I'm trying to get that in today. The due date was today, but I'm having a quality issue with the graphic. So I'm working with the social media manager, and we're just trying to... She's working with me, which I appreciate, but I still want to get it to her by today because the due date is today. I don't know what's going on, but we shall see. I'm just ready for tomorrow. I'm just ready for tomorrow. My appointment's at 12.30, it's 12.10, but I'm about to walk in and see if they can get me in early. I have to pee. But yeah, I just wanted to show y'all my nails. 
before I go in and keep going with my day because I will forget. I always forget that I have my contacts in. I feel like there's something in my eye. Y'all, I'm so aggravated. Oh my gosh. I just want to go home. I'm ready to go home. I got stuff that I need to do. What the freak? Why does Walmart have locks on the dang eyebrow pencils? Why does Walmart have locks on eyebrow pencils? Why do I have to see an associate to get an eyebrow pencil? So then when I'm asking for assistance, they're acting like, oh, I can't, I can't go over there. They might have went on lunch. Then call someone. Oh my, I can't. Hopefully y'all can hear me, but I am packing. I just wanted to show you guys this really quick because I'm about to wrap this vlog up. If y'all can't hear me, clearly it's because I got this fan blasting because it's hot. But I'm about to finish packing. I basically put together my nighttime outfits for when we're on the cruise at night, like eating dinner or just walking around the boat. To me, this was really what I wanted to have organized. Now I can go ahead and start packing my loungewear slash pajamas and leggings, um, sweatpants, t-shirts, you know, all that jazz. I just wanted to make sure that I have my outfits together. And I also separated my jewelry, so I'm not bringing all the jewelry that I have. Um, but yeah, so I'm about to finish packing. I'm going to go ahead and close out this vlog. <laughs> y'all, make sure y'all come back so y'all can get into the cruise vlogs because they're coming. I can't wait to get some content for you guys on the beach, on the boat, just a whole bunch of content. So make sure y'all stay tuned. Not only am I getting content, but I'm also taking a vacay. So that means I'm relaxing. Once I'm done packing, I'm gonna get on my laptop for a little bit because I'm not bringing my laptop with me. I don't even want to see a laptop. I pray that I don't regret this. I pray that I do not need the laptop. I should be good. Everyone knows I'm out of the office. I'm gonna turn on my little email so people know if they email me, I'm not available. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys tune back in, hit the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and leave a comment down below. I know I left abruptly after I left Walmart because I was so mad, but I really didn't do anything but go to FedEx to get the um, boarding passes, and I went to Ulta to get an eyebrow pencil. So y'all didn't miss out on anything but just me having an attitude. That is all for today's video, and I will see you guys in my next one.